Man, what's going on, TAC fans? Hey, uh, man, thank y'all for being there with me this evening. So, I'm doing another host of video. So, man, make sure y'all like, share, subscribe. Check me out on my website at CajunTACSystems.com. And um, I apologize. I'm a little hoarse. I'm kind of losing my voice, getting over a little sickness. Not COVID. So, uh, man, thank y'all for the support. Everything that y'all done for me up until now. And let's keep on going. I appreciate it so, so much. So, uh, I had a company reach out to me by the name of K Tactical. Asked me if I wanted to review a holster. Sure. I'm not going to turn anything down. Absolutely. So, he said, man, go to my website. Pick one out. And let me know which one you want to review and I'll send it to you. So, I went to the website. and They got leather and Kydex holsters. Well, guys, I got more Kydex holsters than I can shake a stick at. So, hey, figured I'd get a leather one. Man, it's been a long time since I put leather on my skin. So, um, we're going to try it out. Uh, he sent me this leather one, Cajun, uh, K-Tactical, and I actually like it. So, it's man, like I said, I got Kydex for days. Uh, just haven't used leather in a long time. So, I figured, why not? So, my first... Oh, oh, let me show y'all. Nothing in her. Cleared it. All right, so when I opened it up, uh, my first initial thought is, man, that red stitching looks awesome. So, I mean, it, it's outlined stitched very well, and it just makes it pop. So I figured, hey, you know, I mean, a little leather holster with some red stitching, come on, I like it. So... First thing I saw is I look at the thickness, and the thickness of this is just perfect. Now, on top of this, y'all, this thing's like 25 bucks, so keep that in mind. Probably one of the cheapest holsters I have, but man, I, I'm, I'm intrigued. So, first thing I saw the inside, I mean, it's like the perfect thickness. It's not too thick, where, you know, they got some of them that are real thick. This is actually like right in the middle, exactly how I would want a leather holster. Perfect width. I mean, it just for me. I mean, it's been, like I said, it's been a while since I had a leather one, but I mean, I like the the thickness of it. I think if they hit it right on the money, okay. Um, they got their name K Tactical right here engraved in it. Let's see if you can see that. So a pretty good little touch. Um, the clip on it, you know, it, it's a very durable clip. Now, I've been just recently here carrying appendix. I've never really been comfortable carrying appendix. I always carried my three to four o'clock is where I typically carry it. But I've been wearing this for about two weeks and carrying my appendix, I'm gonna tell you, it's very comfortable. I'm very surprised uh, that I took to the appendix that good for a couple weeks with this holster. And it is for my Glock, my Glock 23, which I think the same holster is gonna fit your 17, uh, Actually, I think this one fits a 17 as well, but the 19 and the 23 is the same. The clip is amazing. Uh, well, let's not get too carried away. So, I do like the clip. I mean, it, it's just a little regular old clip, but man, this thing is sturdy. It never gave me any problems in the two weeks I wore it. So, I was really surprised with that. And, I mean, that, look at that. So, fits really well. Okay right in my Glock, and I've been carrying it, let's see. Uh, my APX carry. Man. Just like that. Now the retention in it is good enough for me. That's where it's going to sit, it's good with it. I like it. I mean, it fits me well. So, guys, for $25, I mean, really, they outdid themselves. They hit the price point right on the money. You know, Caldex is really what everybody, or the majority of everybody's going to now. And, I mean, I got, as you can see, I mean, I got Caldex for days on every gun that I have has a Caldex holster. Now, this leather's been kind of a treat for me. I'm going to put this holster in my rotation because I really do like it. 
Now, K Tactical, y'all, like I said, they got leather and Kydex. And they also got knives, too. Um, I didn't get a chance to get one of the knives, but I'm either going to buy one or, hey, who knows, maybe they'll send me one to review. I really would like to see what their knives are about. I need me a new EDC knife, so that may be the one to go to. But, all right. So, this against the skin. Real important for me because, I mean, like I said, I just started carrying an appendix and I'm still trying to get the comfortability, the comfortability of it. And it's getting there. It's getting there. You know, I got a little beer gut. So, people with a little gut typically are very uncomfortable in the appendix, but it's been going down, so it's getting a little more comfortable. And I, I'm gonna try to go to everything in the appendix, so that's the plan. Now, at 25 bucks, y'all, amazing. I mean, how can they even, that's, what a great holster for $25. So I gotta give it to them. I mean, wow. I wish I had, I mean, I think this was 30. This is my little minimalist for my black. That was 30 bucks. This is 25. So, you know, super impressed with that. They did really well hitting that price point. Now, let's talk about a couple things that I didn't like, which wasn't many things, but a couple. So, the first thing on my Glock, I have a extended mag release. So, it sticks out a little bit. So, when you put it in here, that was the first problem that I had. So, I mean, guys, I, I'm sure they didn't build it for extended mags, uh, extended mag releases. But, however, I mean, it, it works good. You just got to make sure it folds over. It was just like that. But my first time I put it in, that's what happened. You know, so you just got to be careful. So that and the only other thing, I would like to have seen it flush with the barrel. So it looks like it's, I don't know, maybe an inch. So I'm thinking this fits a 17 as well because it's longer. Or that's just how they make them. You know, I don't know, but I'd like to have seen it blush right here with the barrel and, you know, maybe not having any problems with my extended mag release. Look, good retention. I mean, you know, I, wow, I like it. It fits my Glock perfect. And, I mean, for me, that's, uh, that's exactly what I was looking for. And it being so comfortable, you know, I mean, Appendix for a guy with a beard gut is typically a challenge, but this really kind of made it work, and this will be in my rotation. So I like it for 25 bucks, guys. I mean, a, a leather, it's a no brainer. They did really well hitting the price point on that one. I mean, this is my stem fit holster for my guard, okay? This is one of my main carries. This is my guard that I put, that I want to have my light on it. It, go, it goes on, I'm going to have my light on today. But, so, I got my Kydex people, and it'll always be something that I'll switch. Now, leather, hey, I think I'm probably going to look into a, a couple of different guns that I have with one of these, and I mean, for 25 bucks, I can't lose on that at all, period. So, um, I mean, on a scale from one to 10, Man, I'd give it an eight. You know, if it was, if the extended mag release went right over and I didn't have any problems and it was flush with the barrel, I mean, it would be a, it would be a 9.5. Yeah, for 25 bucks. But hey, a good strong eight, hey, man, y'all did really well with that. Um, I'm looking for another one. I'm gonna get me another one to fit. I mean, I got several other guns that I'm gonna use and we're gonna see what else fits in there too. So uh, guys, that's really about it. Hey, go for 25 bucks if you're looking for a leather holster, man, go get that. K Tactical, y'all. Um, I think they're out of California. So uh, check out CajunTacSystems.com, my website. And I want to give a shout out to a couple people JTS Group, uh, Iron Curtain Customs, let's see, Whisper Tactical, Slim Fit Holsters. And there's a new guy that actually was on YouTube about four years ago. And uh, he just came back to us. His name is uh, Rocho Tactical. Rocho Tactical. So I'm going to have his channel. I'm, I'm digging this guy. Him and I kind of get along pretty well. So, man, y'all go subscribe to him. 
Rochelle Tactical. And um, hey guys, this is Cajun Tactical. Man, I'm signing out. Y'all have a great one. And uh, next time I go on video, I'm sure I have my voice back. So.